where am I? What's happened to me? Damn, that is a serious draft. there. And technically not us. Well, not what you would call us, anyway. I swear to God, asshole, show yourself! Show myself? I've shown. I'm showing. I can't get more showed. Show myself in tears. Where are you? Right here, at the end of your arm. The thing that you so fruitlessly tried to remove. Oh, hello, yes. So oh, perhaps you're smarter than you look. No. Yes. N no. Yes. You, the one talking to me right now, are this... Cuff? Cuff? It's a bit reductive, isn't it? Cuff? Gauntlet, maybe. Van Brace. Oh, Van Brace. Van Brace. Yeah, no, it's definitely Van Brace. No, no, no. This is batshit bananas! Ah, and yet, it's the truth! Stop your hurting me! No! Seriously? No. But what you're doing is completely futile. How is this happening? Well, what were you doing before this was happening, hmm? I was... Doesn't matter. Still here. Whoever is doing this, stop. This is one sick joke. I am out of here. You can't run away from me. I am literally attached to you. Why don't we settle down a bit and talk about ourselves? Talk about our interests in life, perhaps. I am not hearing this. This is all a bad dream. <clears throat> Be careful not to trip on anything. You can also see things? This cannot be fucking real. Listen to me, Frey. How the hell do you know my name? We are bonded. Bonded? What do you mean, bonded? Why is this happening? This is... No. On bond. On bond now. As you can see, you're stuck with me, and I with you. And only you can hear me. Stop! Stop talking! This is completely insane! Frey, slow down. You need to listen to me. No, what I need is to figure... Quiet. What? Hide. Is that a motherfucking dragon? Shh! Don't let it see you. place as well. Uh, that thing out there? I don't think so. I'm sure the creature is far away by now, and besides... What? You won't last long without anything to eat. Fine. And how exactly do you plan on getting out? I believe climbing that wall might be our best option. Hey, Cuff. This 
So if we are bonding... Correction, bonded. Whatever. If we are stuck with each other, then what's your deal? My deal? Who are you? I am what you see. Lovely. And I suppose you'll tell me more if I answer your riddles three? Uh, I don't follow. Never mind. Why were you rusting at that old shop anyway? Good question. I've been wondering that myself. All I do know is that before I visited Earth, I was here in Athia. Wait, what? That means it must be your fault I wound up here. How dare you? It was nothing to do with me. If you must know, I'm as keen to find out what brought us here as you are. So, have you always been this? This? This, this chatty bling. As I recall, no. What do you recall? Hmm. I traveled here. Athia was not my home. I, like you, am an outsider. When I arrived, there was a lot of turmoil between the Tantas. The who was? The Tantas. They were four very powerful women who ruled Athia, each with a special ability. Like what? Magic or something? If by magic you mean the ability to turn me into an inanimate object, then yes. What in all creation is that contraption? It's a smartphone. It's for texting, calling, games, videos, taking selfies, and... Which, by the way, I am not gonna explain to you, so don't bother asking. I know what a selfie is. Really? Not really. What else can that thing do? It also has GPS, which would usually tell me exactly where I am. So where are you? Somewhere between purgatory and hell. It told you that? Sure did. Whoa, what the fuck was that? Oh, one of my talents, if you will. Hmm, it seems like there's a small settlement up ahead. Perhaps we can rest there. And you know that how? What are you? The extent of my abilities is nigh on limitless. I'm a Vambrace, after all. Uh-huh. So, this is Athia? Janoon. Janoon? I thought you said... Athia, big picture. Janoon, small picture. Janoon is part of Athia. I get it. Like New York City versus New York State. Exactly. I think. I have no idea what Newark is. No, not Newark. New York. Is there a difference? About a million. Hey, look at you. I'd be careful. Come on. Don't be shy. Seriously, I wouldn't. Let's just keep moving. Why are you so freaked out by this fella? Whoa! Because it's not as it seems. You tell me that now? Shit! Well, don't just stand there. What the? Don't stop panicking now. Uh. Uh. 
Did I just do that? Well, definitely with my assistance. I did not just do that. We did. I just move shit with my mind. Perhaps our connection has somehow awoken some abilities. I just moved shit with my mind. I just keep hearing I, I, I. I just move shit with my freaking mind! <laughs> yeah, okay, that is something I do now. I do magic, talk to sentient cuffs, kill jacked up beasts. You know what? I'll probably fly next. Now you're just being ridiculous. Oh, that's too far. Good to know there was a line. If you could just master these new abilities, with my help, of course. Um, did you not just see me take out that gnarly beast? Oh, bring it, you mangled monsters. The fuck is up with the animals here? They did seem somewhat altered, didn't they? Makes you wonder what can have caused such a mutation. Yeah. Like, what happened here? Whoa, what the hell? What is this weird feeling? There seems to be some sort of malignant miasma in the air. Okay, turning back now. It doesn't seem to be affecting you though, does it? Besides, I doubt there'd be much benefit in retracing your steps. So this miasma, what exactly is it? It's quite mysterious, isn't it? I suspect it might be what's causing all the local wildlife to look so peculiar. So, how come it doesn't affect me? How come, indeed? Could it be thanks to your commendable choice of traveling companion, perhaps? No, not that. Definitely not that. Nothing but ruins. Looks like no one's been here for a while. I wonder how long everything's been in this shitty state. Perhaps we should find somewhere else to search? There's something there. Okay, so let me get this straight. I'm somewhere that's not what I would call Earth. 
I'm seeing freaking dragons, and oh yeah, I'm talking to a fu- King Cuff! Damn brakes. So much for clean air and bright skies. I try to escape to someplace better, and where do I wind up? Someplace ten times worse. Oh, poor you. Not bad. Thanks, Professor. I told you to call me Vambrace. Sure, Cuff. Sure. Shit! It might be wiser to run this time. No kidding. Okay, this is awesome. I am catching some serious air. Very impressive. Just try not to catch some air into a serious reality break. I could run like the wind, and I'm not even getting tired. Please, try not to get too careful. <sighs> that was close. Where the hell are we now? The big city, I suppose? Hello? Anyone home? Say something if you can hear me. Not a sound. Well, let's keep looking. You should probably keep an eye out for somewhere to rest, too. Let's see what's over there.
Is there not a single person left? It very much seems that way. Perhaps this oddness with the air drove them to escape to safer climes. Hope so. At least that would mean they're still alive. Eh. Let's not be ungrateful now. Let me guess. Bad guys nearby? Got it in one. <laughs> I'd say now's the time to strike! No shit. is it completely empty, but this place is twisted. Perhaps it has something to do with strange creatures prowling about the place? Isn't it about time you took a rest? All good here? Why? You worried about me? Just checking. Maybe don't go charging in for the minute, huh? Sure. Thanks for the heads up. Well, do something. Seems we're free of any immediate danger. Here's hoping it stays that way. It's just up ahead. Uh-huh. Might as well pocket this.
sure a lot of plants around here. Herbal medicines with Janoon stock in trade. Well, that ought to come in handy. Do we really need to go this fast? Thing, I suppose. I'll be the judge of that. Well, this place is fun. I imagine it was once. Happy, smiling faces on every corner. No, I can picture it now. Damn. Everything just looks broken. Not exactly the most poetic of descriptions, but yes, I suppose it does. Is there nowhere that's not, like, broken by this shit? I suppose there might be somewhere. Sounds like trouble. Yes, and given what we've seen so far, I'd say you need to be very careful in case you're planning on investigating. Shit! What is it now? Is this the break shit's doing too? I believe so. It corrupts everything it touches before destroying it completely. Now hurry up and get out of here while you still can. I think we should run. Too late for that. Go 
us make mistakes. Don't worry, you're not gonna die unless you get hit. That's your idea of encouragement? That's not doing much. Yep. See that? So gratifying to see my hard work paying dividends. Ah! Come on, drop dead already. I'm afraid our reptilian friend seems as stubbornly healthy as ever. Nope, not working. Set that up now. Ready on now. Next movement. That was close. Has anyone ever told you how sloppily you move? Hey, fuck off. Ha! That stung a little. No time to recuperate. Stay on your feet.
Do you think it's dead? The dragon? Well, it did get crushed by all that rubble. There's a town up there. Hopefully one that isn't deserted. Well, you'll never find out if you don't go and see. Oh, whoa, oh, hey! Hey! Over here! Oh, we're saved. Huh? The hell? Move, monster! 
Hey, the fuck you calling monster? The monster speaks. Yeah, of course I speak. Put your pointy stick away, asshole. Move. All right, move it. Where are we now? This is the city of Sipor. Why are they speaking English? It's my experience that languages share commonalities across many dimensions. Okay, any answer works for me, I guess. Quiet! Keep moving, fiend! Let me go! Easy. Settle. Settle. Who are you, child? Who are you? I would humble thyself and answer their questions. I got this. I'm used to repping thyself. I don't think you comprehend the gravity of your situation. I got myself out of much tougher scrapes than this, thank you very much. So why don't you shut your shiny mouth and let me do the talking? Good her. She speaks with invisible beings. Does she in cahoots with demons? What? No. And, and who uses cahoots? I would like to hear the answer to Councilwoman Bellet's question, child. My name is Frey Holland. I do not know how I got here. I am exhausted. I am starving, and all I want is to go home. Her vestments are strange. Where is she from? Hell's Kitchen. You see? She is Hell's Spawn. How else could she survive in the corruption? Please. How did you emerge from the corruption of Janu unscathed? I wouldn't exactly say unscathed. It's because she and the corruption are one and the same. We must execute her immediately. Wait, what? No, that's crazy. I don't even know how I got here. Please, listen to me. I believe we need her. Who wishes to address the council? Forgive me. I am Odin Keen. All this woman is guilty of is surviving the corrupted lands. We have much to learn from her. Until now, we've only met her with blades. Perhaps we could extend her a hand of kindness. The devil will accept your kindness, as it bites your hand, spreading its venomous corruption into your veins. We must deal with this interloper swiftly. Councilwoman Ballette, please! Both Odin King and Councilman Janesh have made very compelling arguments. Council is divided. Therefore, there shall be no blood spilled today. But, heed my warning, child. If you prove a threat, we will have no choice but to eliminate you. Take her to the Tower of Binoy. Please, Councilwoman Ballad, your ruling is too harsh. Council is adjourned. She has done nothing wrong. Wait, what, uh, Tower of Benoit? What's the Tower of Benoit? I believe it's a prison. Please! What? Oh, hell no! I'm not getting locked up again! Let me go! Let me go! Don't touch me, asshole! Oh. Get up! Get up. Get up. Get up! Get up! Get up! Look. I am imprisoned, a million miles from home, in a Renfair nightmare. Just let me die in peace. If you die, I'm just a meaningless bauble that they bury you with. And I am fine with that. Just leave me alone. You know what? None of this is my fault. This is all your and, fucking fault. And tell me fault. how exactly this is my fault. Can we just not talk? 
Fine. Fine by me. Suit yourself. I'd love a bit of silence. Fantastic. You say another fucking word. You know, I never thought I'd miss the Hell's Kitchen. Of course it's locked. I doubt you'll be squeezing your way to freedom through there. No shit. Damn it! This is going nowhere! Did that piss bucket do something to annoy you? No. You know what? You did. Because of you, I'm not getting back to- New York? New York. How hard is that to remember? Mm, maybe it's hard to remember as Vambrace? If memory serves me right, you weren't exactly in the best of spirits when our paths first crossed. I'm not sure why you're so determined to return. You know what? I'm just- I'm gonna use magic to bust us out of here. It isn't advisable to use your abilities in front of them. Why not? They already think I'm in cahoots with demons! But they will hang you for being a heretic. What, like a Salem situation? Do you expect me to know what that means? <sighs> Look, we, we did it your way, and now we're gonna try it my way. <sighs> uh. Did I just do that? Quick, put this on. Who's there? I will free you, but you have to put it on and do as I say. Okay, it's on. You. You're the one who stood up for me in court. Why are you doing this? Because I believe you. But we must hurry. How did you sneak past the guards? I prepared a tincture of slumber baked into a pastry. Hmm. Looks can really be deceiving. Let's go before they wake. Wait. Where are we going? What's your angle? Angle? She did defend you in court, and right now she seems to be your only option. Fair point. All right, wherever we're going, there's got to be food. Well, this is serendipitous. You're telling me. Did you say something? What? Uh, uh, no. Please, after you. 